Hello everyone, it's Sarah. Welcome back to Soul Beauty. So, in today's video, I am going to show you guys how I customize a synthetic wig, a beautiful, gorgeous synthetic wig for a special occasion. It's going to be about five steps. So, are you ready? Let's go. The first step is to put the wig on. <laughs> Now sometimes certain synthetic wigs have flyaways, so I'm just adding just a little bit of water to help tame the flyaways. I just want to also mention that this wig is called the Milky Way wig, and she is on sale for $39.99. Yeah, I'll leave the link for you guys so you guys can check it out, and um, yeah, let's get back to the video. So, now that you have your wig on, the next step is to separate your baby hairs. So now that my wig is on and the baby hairs are out, the next step, which is step three, would be to pluck your hairline. So I'm gonna try to make this look as natural as possible. You can use a tweezer, but I am actually going to be using a eyebrow razor. I prefer to use this over a tweezer when it comes to synthetic wigs. If you want to see uh, an in-depth tutorial on how I pluck with a razor, I will leave a video link down below so you can check that out. All right, so I've just um, finished tweezing or removing a lot of the hairs in the front. I just removed some of the hairs in the parting and some of the hairs along here, but I did not touch the sides. I'm actually going to be adding this Kiss Bond lace front wig glue. And I'm going to be applying that just along the front here and allowing it to dry a little bit and then apply the wig over top. I'm going to add in little cuts just along the hairline here. After you've cut your, um, removed a lot of your hairs and framed your baby hairs, you're going to cut in these little slits here in the lace. And step four is to apply your adhesive, okay? So I'll be using this. I'm going to push this back a little bit, like that. I'll clean the front of the hairline with a little bit of um, alcohol. I'm done with step five, which was cutting the lace after applying the glue, and now I just tied my hair. I'm waiting for it to dry, and that should be about 10 minutes. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am done. It literally looks like a frontal wig right now with the extra hair that's like kind of left in the front. But no, it's just a closure wig, you guys. It's just a parting about here. Um, I used a concealer that's about um, the same shade as me um, to help me out as well. I used a couple of the browns and the uh, lighter shades as well. So that is how I would customize my synthetic wig for a special occasion. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Let me know that you liked it. Check the link down below in the description box because this wig is for $39 for a limited time. So check it out. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. I will catch you guys in my next video. Take care.